Hey guys, MC2 Burleson here, and this week I have the opportunity to visit Child Development Center 3 on Joint Base Anacostia Bowling during the month of the military child to show how CDCs enable the Navy's warfighting efforts by providing support to sailors and their families. April is designated as the month of the military child, underscoring the important role military children play in the armed forces community. The month of the military child is a time to applaud military families and their children for the daily sacrifices they make and the challenges they overcome. CDCs provide full and part day early care and education services for children ages six weeks through preschool in a center-based learning environment. They also provide military families a safe and secure location for their children during working hours. In all, there are over 130 CDCs worldwide. All centers use teaching strategies that help develop children socially, emotionally, physically, and intellectually to reach child development milestones and school readiness skills. In line with Sailor 2025, CDCs have extended their hours of operation at many locations throughout the world. The extension was created to better support sailors and their families during difficult work schedules, educational pursuits, deployments, and other family needs. JBAB currently has three CDCs on its base. Here at CDC3, they have extended their working hours from 0500 through 1900, Monday through Friday, to support military families and mission readiness. I spoke with Julie Hamilton, who talked about the benefits of CDCs. We, pro we provide them an environment where they can learn and be creative and just be themselves, interact with other children, and so just so that they learn how to grow on their own. Okay, so what do you enjoy most about working with children? I think what I enjoy most about working with children is just watching them grow. Like seeing that the thing, when they learn new things and then putting those new things to use, that's like the best feeling ever. So how do you help contribute to the military's overall readiness? By being very supportive for the parents and the children and then just being a, a positive figure, stable, you know, so somebody they see every day and just being there for them. Absolutely. So um, what should a parent expect whenever they bring their uh, kid to a CDC? Quality care. You know, we provide, like all our teachers are well trained and, you know, we have a real genuine love for doing this job. So they will get the best care all around. Military families seeking child care can make a request online at militarychildcare.com. This is a DOD centralized website, which allows families to search for and request care, manage their requests, and update their profile online. Simply create an account, then search the system for the child care option that best fits your needs, and submit your request. The program will contact you when the space becomes available. Thanks to CDC3 for allowing me to visit the center, for answering the questions, and thank you all for watching. For CDC info at your location, visit mywfr com and click the child and youth tab for the latest personal news in the fleet be sure to follow the rundown <laughs>